you're drinking it. You better believe it. And it flows in abundance, my friend. See ya. Later on. Let's go talk and try to join. Ahoy there. I'm sorry, I don't think I got your name. It's Bug Eye. Well, I've been doing some thinking, and I'd like to join the Democratically United Brotherhood of the Manatee Interior. Is that so? Yep. Although I'm applying to the Oligarchical Society of the Alpaca Farm as a safety. This wouldn't have anything to do with a missing cochlea, would it? No way. I just like the cut of your jib. Well, admittance is as simple as a unanimous vote, even for a pirate such as yourself. We're a democracy, after all. Noogie, Moose, Santino, and myself founded our collective after growing tired of slaving away on the crews of tyrannical adventurers, always after some meaningless trinket. Like, say, a giant sponge? Precisely! We're never going back to our old lives. The Brotherhood was formed to make sure this adventure is a never-ending one. Down with the man, and all of that. Would you like me to call a vote? Yes, I'm a shoe in Gentlemen, Goldilocks here would like to join the Brotherhood. Sweet. Voting time. My favorite. Brother Noogie, concerning the initiation of one Guybrush Threepwood, what say you? Uh, no. Uh, no, I don't think so. What's he got to offer? Brother Moose, what say you? I gotta vote with my boy Santino on this one. An obvious no. What? This is ridiculous! Yeah, no, nah, bro. And of course, my vote, which is no. Shocker. Not a single yay. This is worse than when I ran for class president. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that's terrible. Sure. Let me out of here and I'll spare your miserable life! <gasps> is that who I think it is? It's locked! Oh. Well. Meet the hook. At least I'm crash. Oh, oh. There! All unlocked. My hook is pretty handy. Uh, but sometimes I miss the old opposable digits. The molecules are synthesizing. The formula is actualizing. Science! I have science here! La mort est tuée. Well... Alright. Let's just get on with this. Woe upon thee, foolish mortal! You have unleashed <laughs> certain doom upon all your feeble fleshy kind! For the wrath of Murray shall be... <laughs> very funny. Hi, Murray! Reapwood! I suppose I should have expected this. Long time no see. How'd you get trapped in here? I'm not trapped! Okay, what were you doing before you chose to hang out in a treasure chest inside of a manatee? Well, my legions of undead marines had brought an armada of Spanish clippers to their knees when a mighty tempest tossed our ship. I don't remember hearing about any battle with the Spanish armada. Ha! As if we would allow a soul to live to tell the tale. Would you like some help? Help? Ha! Help? I will end you! Okay then. Well, it was nice talking to you, Murray. Um, maybe a little. Oh. Come again? Perhaps a lift. Oh, you'd like help. Let's go, pal. Ah, it's dark in here. And why does it smell like rotten marmalade? Uh, okay. The plaque reads, Fish Eyes Alabaster, anarcho-socialist pirate philosopher. One day I hope my portrait has such a fancy plaque, soiled and forgotten in the bowels of a manatee. Well, that's not gonna work. Boy, 
moist, but expedient. Let's try to convince him to let me jump. Hi! Sir. Think I could count on your vote? Man, that's a tough one. I try not to get too wrapped up in the politics of the group. That's the beauty of democracy, man. Let other people make the big decisions, and you can just ride the wave. I just vote for whoever Santino goes in for. See ya. Later on. Uh, it's getting dark again. Hi. Sir. I propose a toast. It's a special occasion. Righteous. What's the occasion? Pirate History Month. Woohoo! Yeah. Well, it's not a clip on. Hi. Sir. Let's try this again. I propose a toast. It's a special occasion. Righteous. What's the occasion? Wally! Woohoo! Oh. Hi! Sir! I pro- Right! Fruit Tuesday! Woohoo! Here we go. <laughs> Threepwood, you have made the greatest mistake of your life. In my new corporeal form, I will scorch these lands to the ground, only to rebuild them in my nefarious almighty image. So, you like your new setup? I do. Santino, bro, you want to spot me on this one? Men pledge their allegiance to me. Our brotherhood is a bond forged in the flames of hell. Gnarly. Perhaps I will revel in this union of brothers for a moment. Before burning the world. Terror will come to this manatee, rest assured. Hey there, Mer uh, Santino. Aloha. Think I can get your vote into the brotherhood? We are very selective of our members. I just scammed your way in 15 seconds ago. How about a nod for the effort? Okay, okay, sure thing, Creepwood. Talk to you later, Murray. Take care, windbag. Now, I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna have Bug Eye allow me in. So if I just can... Ahoy there! Oh, this guy. hi. You're in charge of the tunes, huh? I just like to play. It relaxes me. I can relate. I went through a mouth harp phase. I'm Guyber Streepwood, Mighty Pirate. I'm Noogie. What's your pretty girlfriend's name? Oh, she's not really my girlfriend. Her name's Morgan LaFlay. Why, you think she's hot stuff? Well, yeah. She'd chew you up like a pinky finger in a piranha pool. <laughs> Awesome. <laughs> I could really use your vote to the Brotherhood. Oh, I don't know about that. We got a pretty stable force in here, and I don't think Bug Eye likes you much anyway. Well, let me do you a favor. Like? I'll get you a date with the beautiful, dangerous Morgan LaFlay. Really? You think she'd say yes? To a stud such as yourself? Of course. Wow. Okay. If the date goes well, you have my vote. Deal. In the meantime, here is a new member's manual. It might be worth looking over if you're serious. It's full of our initiation rituals, neophyte duties, etc. Hazing rituals? By law, we're no longer allowed to use the word hazing. 
We call them enhanced initiation techniques. Sounds delightful. One day coming up. Hey, Mo. What is it? It's not really the best time for this, but uh, how about that guy over there? Pretty cute, huh? Four eyes? Kinda portly if you ask me. Come on, you should go on a little manatee date with him. No way. I've feigned enough romance for one day. Well, what about... Did I say date? <laughs> no, I meant reconnaissance mission. He's dangerous. My guess? Assassin. Really? Yeah, really. Here's the play. Shoot! It's a three-phase operation. First, you should... Let's see. Interrogate him. Ask him about himself. Let's figure out where this low life is from. Okay. Second, you must... Take his hand. Test his grip, in case it comes to fisticuffs. Okay. Lastly... So I have a chick for weapons. Scums. Check for weapons. Give him a pat down. When things turn to duck soup, we need to know what we're facing. Okay. Okay, so... Interrogate. Test his grip. And then... Check for weapons. You got it. Good luck. I've got your six. Thanks. Hey, Noogie. That was the date? At first I was really nervous. Yeah? But it turned out great. She was so into me. First, she wanted to know all about me. She was interested right off the bat. Nice. Then she made the first move and took my hand. I knew I was doing well. Second base. Mr. Big Stuff over here. And then before I knew it, she's got her hands all over me. Nah. It was awesome! The perfect date. Glad to hear it went well. So I've got your vote. Certainly! Oh man, I'm putting all of this in my journal. I even found a strand of a hair on my vest. That's going in too, as a keepsake. Getting creepy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, sorry. Yeah, that should be three. Let's try it. Ahoy there! Now what? Alright, call a vote. I feel good about my chances. Very well. Gentlemen, Goldilocks here would like to join the Brotherhood. Sweet. Voting time. My favorite. Brother Noogie, concerning the initiation of one Guybrush Threepwood, what say you? Um, yes. I vote yes. I think he'll help raise... morale. <laughs> Doubtful. Brother Moose, what say you? I gotta go with my boy Santino on this one. Well, Threepwood has recently done me an extraordinary favor. Your vote, then? Of course, my vote is... No! God never! Damn it, I would never allow him to revel in the joy of being a brother! <laughs> I got you a body! <laughs> Making my betrayal all the more evil! I am the king of torment! I shall torture your soul for eternity! Yeah. Nah, bro. Two nays, then. And of course, my vote. Which is no. Shocker. Huh? I'm sorry. Initiation can only be confirmed by a unanimous vote. What about a simple majority and a high five? I don't think so. Oh. Well, let's go talk to the son of a bitch.
Hey there, Mer uh, Santino. Aloha. What's the deal? I do you a favor and this is how you repay me? <laughs> do you think I, Murray, the demonic skull, would ever let you experience the joy of being welcomed into the Brotherhood? Well, yeah, I thought we had a deal. I would rather be reduced to dust than see a smile on your face come induction time. <laughs> of course, if I could see you howling in misery come induction time, you'd have my vote. See you later, Murray. Take care, windbag. Hey, Mo. What is it? I need to infiltrate the Brotherhood and find the missing cochlea. Sounds like a personal problem. Hey, what's with the attitude? I thought you were a fan. I am a fan. I just thought I was a fan of a ruthless buccaneer, not some sensitive pastry chef. Hey, pastry chefs are tough as nails. Okay, I'll be back later. Take your time. Pretend wives sure are fickle. I wonder what my real wife is up to. Probably pining away for her mighty pirate husband. There's something about the open ocean that makes a man feel alive. I would imagine that simply having a pulse is a bit of an upgrade for you. <coughs> How many more of these filthy creatures do we need to unload before we can meet up with Guybrush? Dozens. Seven more islands and one peninsula should suffice. Seven? Listen, Chucky. Drop all the simians on the next patch of dirt you pass and then we find my husband. We can't do that, Elaine. These monkeys need to be given proper homes, far apart from each other, for their comfort and happiness. And ships can roast on an open flame for all I care! Elaine? You don't need that. Oh, I'm so sorry. You're right. I do apologize, monkeys. Lush homes all around. I do apologize for the inconvenience. No need to apologize. Actually, it's crazy to say this, but I'm proud of you. Really? Look at you, going out of your way to set things right. Who ever thought the Chuck would do such a thing? It's only the beginning. say about giving a nod to old Guybrush Threepwood come voting time. Sure. Come on, what? Wait, really? You can have my vote as soon as you beat me in a pirate face-off. We don't want any weenies in the Brotherhood. Is this gonna hurt? Just your pride, Johnny Cakes. I give you my best pirate face, and then all you have to do is top it. Originality counts. I'm a pirate with a face. This should be a cinch. Ready? I'll go first. All right, we're ready for some pirate face-off action. It's Bug Eye, the Viceroy of Visages, versus... Uh, uh, Guybrush Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Let him have it, Bug Eye. It's the... Arr, stinky, lazy-eyed, meanie. <laughs> All right, my turn. Do your worst, Guybrush. 
show this egalitarian bozo who's boss. Now check this out. Well, I don't have anything. He's got the R. Stinky, lazy-eyed, meanie. Ha! That's it? Yep. Did you miss me saying originality counts? Or are you such a pathetic pirate that you had to copy my face to a T? Really, Guybrush? Come on. I added my own flavor. He might as well have been looking in a mirror. This is humiliating. Yeah, it's so all yeah. Mighty pirate indeed. <laughs> Ouch. Bummer, dude. It just slipped out of her hand. Watch, she'll realize her mistake and hurry back for it. Oh. Wait for it. <laughs> Wait. So, pirate faces. Better go cop a few new mugs if you want to upgrade from miserable embarrassment to just simple failure. An original signed Guybrush Threepwood. Morgan's gonna want this back. Doogie, my man. Arr! Yarr! Ooh, that's a good one. I'll add that to my pirate face repertoire. Hey there, Mer Santino. Aloha! Arr! <laughs> Your contorted cast couldn't scare a schoolgirl! In my day, I could turn a man to stone with a smirk! I can make blood boil with a scowl! And all I need is a reason! And lips. Talk to you later, Murray. Take care, windbag! It reads, The Democratically United Brotherhood of the Manatee Interior, a guide for the newly initiated. The first chapter is Initiation and You. Oh, the cover is loose. Technique. Hey, Mo. What is it? Arr! Arr! Ooh, that's a new one. Ah, deckhand. Could you do me a favor? Shoot. I'm parched. I would love a drink, but none of that yellow muck. Dangerous stuff, that is. Makes my eyes go wilder than a frothing Pomeranian. Okay. One drink coming up. Monocular run off to slippery devil. Sneaky. Hey, you, rabble rouser. Yes. Are you enjoying your time with the democratically united brotherhood of the Manatee Interior? How can I not? Can't wait to be voted in. We'll see about that. In the meantime, I don't want any trouble. We got it nice and easy down here. Okie dokie. Just some friendly advice. Don't be poking around up top and stay away from Dakava. The last thing this manatee needs is his sense of direction restored. 
We don't need to be getting to any sacred mating grounds. Seriously. I've never seen manatees mate before, but I'm pretty sure I don't want to be inside one when I do. I'm glad we're on the same page. Ah, bro. Glad to see you're indulging. I wonder if this will wash off some of the grime. Not strong enough to cut through the dirt. My man! I like the beat. How about something a little more up tempo? Like this? I dig it. a little more up-tempo. Like this? I dig it. Oh. One cup of horribly corrosive, ultra-toxic manatee bile. Delish. Manatee bile, the ocean's natural salt. Whoa, check out those peepers. They should do nicely. should really return this to their local library. Modern torture made easy. Yeah, I really hate to break a sweat while breaking the wills of my enemies. Creepy. But kind of cute. interest you in this torture manual? Aha! I wrote the book on torture. For instance, taunting a man with his greatest desire is a good form of psychological warfare, as is an Indian rub. How so? Do you yearn to reap the incredible benefits of membership of the Brotherhood? Sure. That'd be okay. Well, I'll never let you in, ever! Does it scorch your insides, <laughs> Threepwood? Does it fill you with painful sadness and gas? Something does, but I think I swallowed some bile earlier. With a little elbow grease, I can swap the covers on these two books. 
Thank you.